Hey, I'm Kate Bishop, the Director of Children's and Family Ministry at Shady Grove United Methodist Church here in Short Pump. Thank you for joining me. Yesterday was the first Sunday of Advent, the time we prepare our hearts for Christmas. Advent is the time we think about the birth of Jesus. This week, we'll be moving through the homes of our Shady Grove staff and learning about how each of us brings the meaning of Christmas into our own homes. I love getting ready for Christmas. I especially love the lights. And this year, I started pulling out my favorite decorations the beginning of November. I felt ready to have lights brighten the dark corners within my homes. My living room is one of those rooms that I really don't use a lot. But each year, I really look forward to the feeling that the Christmas lights bring to that room. And one of my favorite trees is my angel tree. And I place it between my living room and my dining room. And my kit, so I can see it from both rooms. My kitchen is right behind the camera. So I can see it also from my kitchen. And I love that because I get to see these lights from three areas in my house. And it's full, it's a skinny little tree and it's full of angels. Um, each angel has a special memory and brings me joy of that memory when I look at it. Um, this angel here was given to me by a little girl in my preschool class many, many years ago, and her name was Garland. And she's probably now in high school or maybe even older than that, but I still remember Garland every year when I put this little angel on my tree. And I remember that sweet little girl. I love that. Um, let's see, let me see another angel. Um, this angel was given to me by a special friend in a Bible study class. I think it's so, she's very beautiful. And I always think of Lisa when I look at this angel every year. I don't see her, but I remember her every year from my tree. These angels, these little paper angels were created one Christmas at Create and Celebrate at Trinity United Methodist Church. It was an annual Advent craft night where we would get together and we would make a craft and then we would have a family style dinner and then we would um, get a visit from the Snow Queen and Santa Claus. And it was a really special evening for my family. And it was the starting point of Advent. So I have several little crafts from Advent, but, but the angels, I just love those. A few years ago, I started painting these tiny little angels on these tiny little canvases. And so each angel is different. And they bring me a lot of comfort and joy and peace when I look at them because I had that feeling when I was painting them. So I have that on my tree. And they just kind of sit up in here like this. This little angel. No, this little angel. I'll show you this one. This represents the spirit of giving to me. My daughter painted this angel for me when she was about nine, and she painted it as a surprise with a lot of love, and she was so excited to give it to me. She had so much love and so much excitement that it just represents the spirit of love and the spirit of giving, and I love that. So she lives right, she's right up here. I don't always put them in the same spot. This angel, was given to me by a 90 year old woman at my church, or maybe she was 80 years old, I don't know. But she, this woman had collected angels all her life, all throughout her life, and she shared this one with me. And I was inspired to create my own angel tree because of her. And each year I remember her, and I remember her um, kindness and her wisdom and the gift of this angel. Luke 2.10 says that while shepherds were watching their sheep in the fields, an angel came to them and said, Do not be afraid. 
for I bring you good news and great joy for all the people. And I think of angels as messengers who bring comfort and peace and good news. The angels on this tree sure bring me comfort and peace and serve as a reminder of Jesus. And I love the light that shines through here and I love looking at it in my house and it, and, um, and it's one of my most special parts of Advent in my house. Let's pray. Dear God, thank you for sending angels to bring comfort and peace and good news. Thank you for lighting our world with the gift of Jesus. Amen.